Hey everyone and welcome to our YouTube channel. This video will be a tutorial on how you can set up shipping on Shopify using Zendrop. Zendrop has a variety of highly valuable capabilities optimizing the entire supply chain from product sourcing to order fulfillment. So I will provide a full walkthrough of the platform highlighting features that can save you a lot of time, plus unlock profit opportunities unavailable using conventional channels. But before we get into Zendrop's suite of solutions, it's very important to establish proper context around dropshipping complexities that they aim to solve in the first place. And as an overview, the underlying dropshipping model allows anyone to operate e-commerce outlets completely without physical inventory by coordinating the fulfillment directly between suppliers and end consumers per order, which allows you to retain flexibility to test ideas without upfront risks or logistics overheads. However, the lack of friction also invites a lot of competition from rising digital merchants. And this invites some complexities such as the product sourcing, identifying uniquely differentiated yet reliably supplied merchandise, avoiding a lot of catalogs. Order processing is another one, seamlessly syncing multi-channel purchases with suppliers, trigger rapid fulfillment and notifications. Another one is customization as personalizing packaging and marketing to boost perceived brand quality and loyalty. So cultivating the positive customer experience across these kind of areas is infinitely harder, coordinating various software tools and overseas vendors manually. So Zendrop aims to resolve these supply chain limitations with tools tailored for e-merchants from end to end. Let's get more specific into it. And how does Zendrop benefit over AliExpress? AliExpress has traditionally been the default platform for dropshippers because of its expansive supplier catalog spanning manufacturing hubs like China. However, over the years, considerable pain points emerged around shipping lags, order tracking complexities, product consistency, and lackluster data transparency. And that's where Zendrop seeks to correct these weaknesses, adopting an optimized dropshipping ecosystem. And the first benefit is the lightning fast processing and delivery. By nurturing relationships with purpose-built supplier networks rather than a marketplace, Average fulfillment and delivery is heavily enhanced from AliExpress's 25 to 40 days down to just 5 to 8 days. This is a critical advantage in worlds where consumers expect near instant gratification. So these domestic focused supply chains also ease accurate order monitoring versus the complex international points that are usually prone to black holes. Additional benefits would include auto-synced order management, packaging personalization, as Zendrop enables easily incorporating logo stickers, stylized tissue paper, thank you cards with discount promos, and so much more so that you can stand out to the customers. And now I'm going to walk you through the account creation process and how you can set it up with Shopify. We're going to navigate to their homepage at zendrop.com. From there, you will land on the homepage where you can create a free account granting basic access, or you can simply just click in the link in our description box down below, we'll have it available to you. So from here, you want to hit create a free account. And then after that, you want to fill out the application form using accurate details that later are tied to taxation. But you will have to simply input your full name, business email address, a secure password, and phone number. Once you've put in your details, click create account. After confirming your email, we're logged into a dashboard with starter resources plus prompts to connect Shopify store. And this is the first thing that we want to tackle. This is the step that allows tracking orders flowing from e-commerce platform directly to suppliers for fulfillment purposes later on. So to onboard, input the full store domain that you have on Shopify, you can find it right here. And then authorize your permissions for Zendrop's application and just like that, you have synced your Shopify store. The next step would be the product research and importing. This is where you want to navigate to the products module so that we can leverage Zendrop's built-in database, which helps identify the potentially winning merchandise aligned to customer interests across 50 plus categories. I would recommend punching targeted keywords first into the search fields so that you can reveal the demand like review ratings, monthly sales volumes, and recent performance on important listings. This is extremely useful to gauge the existing demand. We can also filter by supplier regions or product traits like available images. And once items with potential are spotted, clicking listings reveals detailed descriptions, shipping schedules, and the cost breakdowns like landed prices so that you can accurately calculate margins. So when satisfied, simply click add to my products to seamlessly import merchandise into your own catalog for further tweaking before publishing it live to your store. And good news, while basic Zendrop account limits listings, 
Volume restrictions expand with higher tier plans accommodating the serious scaling. But still, their starter library offers a lot of testing room so that you can identify winning products. And now with Shopify connected, plus the initial products imported, I'm going to walk you through the streamlining order workflows. Navigating to Zendrop's order panel reveals purchase notifications flowing in automatically from stores, along with tools so that you can quickly approve or reject them for fulfillment directly with stock checked suppliers. Clicking into the individual requests, we additionally spot tracking codes auto assigned once shipments are handed off across logistic partners. And this ends the sequence of manually relaying order details externally and then reassociating confirmations repeatedly. And for those desiring even greater oversight, Zendra Plus Plan unlocks the auto fill toggle which automatically approves orders for suppliers while attaching tracking references back into the marketplace. And this reduces tremendous operational workload. Next up, I want to talk a little bit about the pricing and the plan perks. Given Zendrop's baseline feature set aimed at refining dropshipping, is the Pro Plan or even the Plus Plan worth upgrading to? The Pro Plan, starting at $49 per month, offers the same features in the free one, obviously. And additional features, the most important one would be the unlimited orders per month, automated fulfillment, custom branding, and US products. So of course, if your business is scaling up and you would need more products, and automated fulfillment, then you definitely should be upgrading to this plan. You would find tremendous value in it. And the plus plan starting at $79 per month, it's not that much of an increase in price compared to the pro plan. However, the additional features personally did not suit me. Although some people could find a lot of value in the Zendrop Academy, I personally did not find anything that appeals to me in the Academy itself. There are other features like subscription boxes, chargeback management, trending product finder and more. But then again, I find the pro plan the best when it comes to price to value ratio. So again, sort out your needs and which features you actually need for your business instead of going for the most expensive plan, thinking it will offer you the most value. And that will be a wrap for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Let us know what you think in the comment section down below or if you have any other questions about Zendrop or dropshipping. And if you found today's video to be helpful or informative to watch, then give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel so that you don't miss out on any follow-up content that we can make related to this one.